Have you ever wondered what would happen if an iceberg, one of the mightiest forces of nature, smashed into a huge U.S. Navy nuclear aircraft carrier? We're talking about a monster ice cube colliding with a floating city, packed with thousands of sailors and millions of pounds of jet fuel, not to mention the dangerous nuclear system on board. Icebergs are no strangers to aircraft carriers, destroyers, and even cruise ships. Icebergs, mysterious and formidable, are a natural marvel and a potential threat to vessels due to their massive underwater presence. Only 10% is visible above water. These icy giants can tower up to 300 feet above water and weigh a whopping 10 million tons. Icebergs and aircraft carriers share a common attribute, the potential for wreaking havoc if they're tampered with. It's a crash that could be an environmental disaster unlike anything we've ever seen. Massive flooding, crumpled metal as far as the eye can see, and the potential release of nuclear radiation into the seas. Nuclear aircraft carriers are equipped with some of the most advanced navigation and detection systems in the world. These systems must detect any obstacle, any threat, and yes, any iceberg, long before there is a risk of an impact. Radar and sonar technologies are crucial for these tasks. They constantly scan the ocean above and below the surface, looking for signs of potential dangers. But it's not just a matter of detection. When a potential threat is identified, these ships must be able to maneuver quickly and effectively to avoid a crash, all while safeguarding the well-being of the crew and the integrity of the mission. But what happens if all technology fails? What if an iceberg is detected too late? How does the crew of such a gigantic ship respond to an emergency? In such a scenario, all hands are immediately called on deck, with officers and sailors rushing to man their posts and initiate emergency procedures. The command bridge becomes a nerve center of communication and decision-making, with the captain and his officers working meticulously together to bring the ship to safety. The helmsmen, whose hands hold the fate of the entire ship, must maneuver with the utmost precision and speed to avoid the looming danger. Every movement of the rudder, every adjustment of the course, must be executed with the greatest care and accuracy. In such critical moments, there is no room for error. A minor misstep can lead to irreparable damage and loss. Meanwhile, the machines and engines are pushed to their limits with engineers and technicians working to draw every available power from the nuclear reactors to enable an immediate and powerful response. The gigantic turbines are put into overdrive, the power is maximized, and the ship tries to evade the immense object. Air crews and pilots are also mobilized. Their eyes become the eyes of the ship, and they can scan the surroundings to get a better picture of the extent of the threat and to determine the best possible route to avoid an impact. Their observations and reports become crucial for making real-time decisions and adjusting strategies to the unfolding situation. And what if, despite all these efforts, the crash is inevitable? What if the steel giant cannot escape the embracing grip of the ice in time? Before we continue, Let's take a moment of respect for the victims of the Titanic disaster, who tragically lost their lives after crashing into an iceberg. As a tribute, please leave a blue heart in the comments. If an aircraft carrier were to crash into an iceberg, it would undoubtedly be an unprecedented and catastrophic event. The sheer magnitude of such an impact would lead to dire consequences. The iceberg, often lurking beneath the surface and obscured by the frigid waters, would strike the carrier's hull with unimaginable force. The result would be an immediate breach of the carrier's defenses below the waterline, 
causing flooding in critical compartments. The severity of the situation would be compounded by the vessel's size and the limited time available for the crew to respond. Despite the U.S. Navy's rigorous training and emergency protocols, the crash would likely lead to a significant loss of lives among the carrier's crew. The crew's dedication to damage control and search and rescue operations would be tested to its limits. But the brutal reality is that many sailors would find themselves in harm's way, as proven by history. Bear in mind that the iceberg's impact wouldn't be limited to the immediate hull breach. The consequences would ripple throughout the entire carrier. The flight deck, which is usually overwhelmed with aircraft operations, would be left in shambles. Aircraft, including multi-million dollar jet fighters, would be damaged or destroyed along with munitions and aviation fuel. As one may expect, the financial cost of repairing such a colossal vessel would be astronomical, running up into the billions of dollars. The U.S. Navy's budget and resources would be strained to their limits, diverting funds from other vital defense projects. Plus, the time required for extensive repairs could disrupt the Navy's strategic readiness and global presence, impacting national security interests. One of the most alarming aspects of such a collision would be the potential loss of a nuclear asset. Aircraft carriers are powered by nuclear reactors, and the damage inflicted by the iceberg could jeopardize the safety and integrity of the reactor containment. In the worst-case scenario, a breach of the reactor containment could lead to a nuclear accident, releasing radiation and posing a significant threat to the ship's crew, the environment, and nearby vessels. Beyond the immediate human and financial costs, the environmental consequences would be very significant. The release of fuel, hazardous materials, and the potential for nuclear contamination into the sea could result in long-term ecological damage, impacting marine life and coastal regions. The collision of an aircraft carrier with an iceberg is a nightmarish scenario fraught with loss of lives, extensive damage costs, environmental concerns, and the potential for a catastrophic nuclear incident. It underscores the immense challenges and risks associated with naval operations in extreme conditions and serves as a stark reminder of the critical importance of preparedness, training, and advanced technology to mitigate and prevent such disasters. Detection and Monitoring Established in 1913, following the Titanic disaster, the International Ice Patrol monitors iceberg dangers in the North Atlantic, issuing crucial warnings to the maritime community, employing advanced technologies including GPS and satellite data, the IIP effectively tracks iceberg movements, especially between February 1st and July 31st, when the risks are most acute. The recent initiative, Operation Titanic, spearheaded by the U.S. government, seeks to revolutionize iceberg detection by integrating satellite-based radar imagery with ship reporting systems, enhancing maritime safety 110 years after the Titanic tragedy. Despite these advancements, icebergs continue to pose significant navigational risks, with about 1,000 icebergs tracked annually. The U.S. National Ice Center, or NIC, oversees global iceberg monitoring, holding the responsibility for analyzing and forecasting ice conditions and tracking all Antarctic icebergs. Advanced Technologies in Modern Fleet Operations In the vast and unpredictable expanses of the ocean, the ability to detect looming threats is paramount. Modern radar systems, imbued on every naval vessel, act as the vigilant eyes of the fleet, scanning the horizon with unparalleled precision to detect potential obstacles, even in the most adverse weather conditions. These radar systems are complemented by advanced sonar technologies, delving into the hidden depths of the ocean to unveil the secrets below the surface 
safeguarding the vessel against submerged threats. In conjunction with radar and sonar, the innovation of satellite technology provides an unprecedented layer of situational awareness. Satellites orbiting the Earth relay crucial real-time data, painting a comprehensive picture of the maritime environment, enabling the fleet to navigate with heightened accuracy and confidence. This synergy of technologies empowers the U.S. Navy to meticulously chart its course through icy waters, evading the concealed dangers that icebergs present. Yet the brilliance of these technologies is not static. The relentless pursuit of excellence drives continual advancements and refinements, aiming to elevate the standards of maritime safety and navigation. This unwavering commitment to technological innovation underscores the Navy's dedication to preserving the well-being of its crew and ensuring the success of its missions amidst the ever-present challenges of the sea. Icebergs have been a long-standing hazard at sea. The U.S. Navy has significantly evolved its navigational capabilities to detect and avoid such hazards, ensuring the safety of its operations and crew. We pay respect to those who vigilantly serve and protect, navigating safely through the ocean's perils. Whether you're a seasoned Navy veteran or just someone interested in maritime affairs, we want to hear from you. What do you find the most fascinating thing about life at sea? or the Navy in general? Leave your comments down below. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like, and if you loved it, then please subscribe to our channel. By doing so, you'll be showing us your support, which we truly appreciate and cherish. Keep an eye out as we continue to bring more entertaining and educational content on the U.S. Navy and other maritime topics. So hit that bell icon so you'll receive a notification every time we post a new video. Thank you so much. I will catch you in the next one.